I'm Tom Huckabee, and I'm the artistic director of the Wildcatter Exchange, and I'm here to tell you about part of the festival that I'm very excited about, and that is the four tall guys from Austin. Uh, most of them are old friends of mine. We have John Burnett, a correspondent for NPR. You probably heard him on All Things Considered. He spent a couple years as the religious correspondent for NPR, and he's going to be talking about that and presenting some of the uh, tapes that he recorded going around the country of sacred music in backwoods churches of America. And there's Jesse Sublet, who's a musician, novelist, uh, nonfiction writer. He has a new book out called 1960s Austin Gangsters that he's going to be reading from and signing books. And there's Turk Pipkin and his wife, Christy. Turk is a mime, actor, comedian, writer, author, but he's also a philanthropist. And he's going to be uh, with his wife talking about their nobility project, where they got uh, nine Nobel Prize winners to identify problems in the world. And then they go out and try to solve the problem and make movies about it. And he'll be showing his latest film called Building Hope. And uh, that we're doing on Sunday, actually showing the complete film. Only a couple of films are being shown in the festival. Uh, but that'll be at shipping and receiving at 6 o'clock on Sunday. On Saturday in the afternoon, they'll be just talking about their philanthropic activities. And then the last tall guy from Austin, apparently he's not as tall as he used to be. He told us he used to be 6'2", now he's only six feet. But uh, his name is Tom Ziggle. He's the only one I actually have never met. And, but he'll be presenting a book of his called Many Rivers to Cross, I believe, something like that. Forgive me because I just don't know him very well. But I'm looking forward to meeting him. He's supposed to be a fantastic writer. And uh, I'll look forward to seeing all of you at the festival.